Grab two bands and go diagonal just like that. Grab another two bands, go diagonal, push these bands down, and grab another two bands and go in the middle. Then you're gonna go down on the side with your hair color, but not the middle. Just like that. And both sides. Then you're gonna grab your hair. You're gonna grab two bands of your skin color, and you're gonna go down on the middle and on the sides, doing one row of two bands, just like that. Then you're gonna go one more down in the middle, and you're gonna grab two more two bands, just like this, and you're gonna go diagonal. And then you push those bands down and do the same thing on the other side. Push those bands down, grab another two bands of your skin color, and go down in the middle. Grab your neck. Then you're going to switch to your, your t shirt color. And you're going to switch And then you go down diagonally, just like that. And on this side. Push those bands down and do the middle. Then you're going to go down on the sides once more. Push those bands down. And then you're going to go down to this peg on the bottom and you're going to grab two of your shirt color and you're going to go down just like that. Grab another two bands. Go down right here. Then you're going to grab two of your skin color, go down just like that, then you're going to grab another two of your skin color, go down, and you're going to do the same thing on the other side. So grab the two bands of your shirt color, go down just like that, and another two of your skin color, I mean, hold on, my bad, the shirt color, and then two of your skin color. And then one more, two more of your skin color. Then you're going to grab one single band and you're going to cap it around this peg three times. Twist, go over, twist, and pull over. That's three. Do the same thing on the other peg. You're going to take your single band, twist it, put it back over itself, twist it again, and pull out. You've completed placing the bands your arms and now you will hook start hooking the arms so you will go in those bands push back the cap in pull those two bands and pull it upwards just like that and then you're going to go in again and grab those bottom two bands pull it forward
Hopefully, I'll be still doing it again. Or I'll probably need to replace it and go out. Now you're going to use the clip. Put them on the on these bands and pull it upwards and just take it off of your wound so you have one of your arms. You're going to push that this peg down. You're going to go back up your wound and push that band down. And you're going to attach it to your wound just like that. And then you're going to do the same thing for the other side. Go in, grab it, and pull it off of your wound. And you're going to put it on, you're going to push those bands down, and you're going to do the same thing for the other side. Just like that, so that it's attached to your wound. And then you're going to grab two more of your teal color bands. You're going to go down the middle again. And I gotta get some bands. Okay, now then you're gonna grab two, another two of your bands. Go down right here. I'm gonna switch and then do the same thing on the other side. I'm gonna switch to yellow right here. I'm gonna go down the middle once. And then go down on the sides once. So go down on each side. Just like that. And then you're gonna, and I'm gonna close this off with I'm gonna grab my pants color I'm gonna be using green and I'm gonna switch to that real quick Matt back on and use your two color and go down with your gray green bands or whatever you're using for your pants and go down on each side then you're gonna Cross it in, so taking a single band, you're going to cross it in just like that, diagonally, push that band down and do the same thing on the other side, push those bands down, and then you're going to grab another two bands of your, your pants car, go down, grab another two bands, and go down the sides, you're not going to do the middle, because you want it to be separate, like apart from each other. Just go all the way down to your room until you reach the end of your room. And just like that. And I have to put this down here. Okay. And then you're going to grab your, another two bands and finish it off right there. And then you have finished placing the bands except for the triangles. So you're going to start up at your room, at the top of your room. You're going to grab two black bands. Um, for your eyes, or you can use any color for your eyes, and you're gonna take and wrap it around this peg four times. So twist, put it back over yourself, twist, put it back over yourself, twist, and pull it back over yourself. And you're gonna repeat on the the other peg, just like this. Twist, put it over itself, twist, put it over itself. And twist and put it over. So now you're gonna take another one of your skin color. You're gonna, I'm using tan, and you're gonna put a triangle on top of it. And then you're gonna grab your hook again, and you're gonna grab those black bands on the bottom. Make sure you're outside, and you're just gonna pull it over. You can do how many you want at a time. I, I like to do two at a time. And you're gonna grab those black bands from the bottom. And oop, mine, mine snap off. So you, it's just the same thing. You just twist, pull it back over yourself, twist, pull it out of and twist. And then you're gonna take that band, or then just do that. And then you're gonna have to do the same thing on both sides. Grabbing those, I push them up and down, pull it over just like that. And then you're going to grab those bands on this side, and you're going to pull it over, just like that. Okay, now those will be your eyes, and then you're going to add one, one of your tanning bands, go right here to here, push the band down, and then add the triangle band, and you're going to get your teal color, and you're going to go over just like that, and... Here you're gonna double. Not you're not gonna just do it. You're gonna twist it and loop it back over itself. So it's double twisted, just like that. And I'm gonna go one more down, right here. 
so your room looks like this and now you're gonna go to the bottom you can grab your shoe cover i'm gonna use this white blue and you're gonna twist you're gonna put it over this peg twist it put it back over so and twist it so you're wrapping it around that peg three times then you're gonna repeat on the other side you're gonna twist pull it back over itself twist and pull it back over itself and you have completed the room and you can now get ready to hook so now you're gonna go in push back that cap in and grab those two bands on top and on the bottom and i think yeah i got one band oops there and now that you got the both bands you're gonna go in again grab those two bands and pull it up grab those two bands but and wait until you get to the top right here right here and you're gonna go and grab that top single band that we placed that goes diagonally right here so you're gonna find that band you're gonna pull it upwards grab the wrong band you're gonna grab that band the single band make sure you're only grabbing one band so just like that oh gosh I keep grabbing the one the other band if that ever happens just pull out the sides just like that and both sides and after this and then you're gonna grab that single band on top I don't know why I'm having so difficult with this. Okay, I think I got it. Where did I? Nope. Just have to restart again. But if if you have trouble like this, just pull out the other bands, and you can skip this part if you got that top single band. Alright, just like that. So now you're going to go in and grab those two bottom bands and pull it up, just like that. Do the same thing. Make sure you're not grabbing those, uh, those triangle bands, just grabbing those bottom two bands. If you grab those triangle bands, it'll look funny at the ends when you take it off so and it might not work and you're going to grab those teal bands on the bottom go in again grab those teal bands and then you're going to go up on that arm area then you're going to push all those bands back and grab those bottom two bands i got one okay just like that and now, and now you're gonna do the same thing on the other side. You're gonna push back that cap end, and then you're gonna bring up those green bands, or your or whatever your pants color is. Go in and grab those green bands again, and you're gonna pull it upwards on the top edge of, above it, and go in again, grab those top bands. Then you're gonna grab that single band. And pull, and pull it over. Make sure your all your hooked ones look like teardrops. And you're gonna grab those two bands, bottom bands again. Hook forward, bottom two bands, and hook forward all the way to the top, like I'm doing right now. And once you get to this arm right here. You might have to stretch your arm out a little bit so you can see you a little more. Push back those bands, grab those two bands, and look forward. And then you're gonna go in this these bands, push those bands back, grab those teal bands, and pull it forward. Just like that. Grab those yellow bands. Pull it forward, grab the teal again, and just go forward just like that. There's no need to cross it in because you're in the middle. And then you're going to push back all these bands 
grab those teal bands and tan bands, my bad. And you're gonna hook it forward just like that. Then you're gonna grab your top two bands, hand bands, which mine are going to th this way, and here should be two. Then you're gonna grab those next top two bands diagonally, and then you're gonna grab those middle bands and hook forward. And then you're gonna push back these bands and pull forward just like that. Then you're gonna go do the same, go up one more. And just like that, go in again and grab those bands and hook diagonally. That connects to this peg and push those bands back. Grab those bands and hook it forward. And push those bands back again and pull your 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 brown bands or whatever you use your hair color back in, in front and then you're gonna go then you're gonna hook it diagonally in just like that and then you're gonna hook the middle just like that and then you're gonna push back all those bands grab that those whatever random color you used and pull it forward all those bands and then you have completed the, the boy and you can just stick your hook through that, that all those bands grab a ring a single band put it on your hook and then you're gonna pull it through make sure you're under all those bands and put it back over itself and tie a slip knot just like that pull it tight make sure it's tight and then you're gonna take it off your loom just like that Make sure your make sure your bands are looked all like teardrops before you took it off your room. Just gonna take it off your room, pulling off the middle. You can kind of use your fingers for this. Pull upwards, brown those bands, pull those up. And we're gonna just go back in there again and grab all those bands and pull up. Just like that. Go in. Take off those. Go in here. Take off those. And then you can, right here, once you've got done, you can just basically use your fingers to take it off of your loom. Just like that. So when you're done, your 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 figure should look like this. Uh, if if you use different colors, um, you you gonna want to stretch out the head and push out those black bands that we put on earlier. And there you have you have your very own boy.